guys, welcome back. So, um, in this video, I'm going to be answering some questions which you guys asked me over on my Instagram. So, I'm going to do my best to answer them. So, let's get into the video. The first question is, what triggers you? Um... I'm guessing this is in terms of my eating. Um, I think my main triggers are when people post pictures of their meals on Instagram and then I start comparing it to my meals and then I think I'm eating too much and then that kind of triggers me. Um, also when people comment on my weight, that really triggers me. When people say like, oh you've gained weight or you're looking healthy, that just triggers me. I don't know. A lot of thing, a lot of things trigger me that I don't realise trigger me. If that makes any sense, but yeah. Next question is: At what age did you start with your eating disorder? So, I started mentally having issues with food when I was around eleven, I think. And um, that's when I started really worrying about my weight and what I was eating. And yeah, but nothing like dramatic happened I guess until I was around 16 when my eating issues really got out of hand. When did you choose to recover? I have chosen to recover many times but have always ended up in a relapse but this time I chose to recover in November 2017. Um, so far every time on this account you said a couple of times you were giving up but you, each time you eventually chose for recovery again how did you pick yourself up again and again um i honestly don't really know um i think just having the support of all my followers really helps me because i have a lot of really close friends that i've made um, and they always manage to make me realise that I'm being really stupid if I choose to relapse and that it's just going to make recovery harder and I've come so far now so why waste all of my hard work I've put. Um, and also, it's just, life's just too short to be worrying about food and weight and I just need to focus on other better things except for food. <laughs> what made you doubt your recovery journey? I think, in all honesty, just the feeling of not being good enough for recovery and that my life isn't really going anywhere. I don't really have much going for me and the weight gain also has made me doubt my recovery journey. And I just don't really feel like mentally I'm getting any better. What made you realise that you had an eating disorder and when? Um, it was probably when I was diagnosed with anorexia when I was 16 from my GP, but even then I didn't really think I had an eating disorder, I thought they were just lying to me, but I guess that was when like a professional told me you have an eating disorder, but up till then I had no idea, I thought I was just being healthy and losing weight. <laughs> what do you study or want to study? Um, so currently I am a nanny, um, but in September I am going to be studying creative media, um, which I'm really excited about. So that's all stuff like we do like animation work, um, graphic design, just social media kind of things. And I don't really know where that's going to lead, but hopefully somewhere cool. Favourite place to visit? Um, out of all the places I've visited, my favourite place is probably Berlin. I went to Berlin with my dad a few times and I just felt so at home there. I just felt like I really want to live here forever and ever. Um, I loved it so much and everyone was really nice. Um, but my favourite place that I would like to visit that I haven't been to is definitely Australia. That is like my number one place that I want to end up visiting at some point. So yeah, those are the end of the questions. There weren't many questions um, because I just posted it. But thank you for your questions. If anyone has any other questions, don't be afraid to leave them in the comments below and I'll answer them in an upcoming video. Um, but I just want to say thank you for all the love and support on my last video as well. Um, it truly meant a lot to me. Um, I am struggling, but I'm, I'm going to get through it. Um, so yeah, short, short but sweet video. Not very sweet. But um, thank you for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video.